So I found Route 1 here in Cary, North Carolina. It's really noisy here. It's this big four lanes in each direction highway. But it is just about the midway point between Fort Kent, Maine and Key West, Florida. So that's why I started here. There's several reasons that I came to Raleigh to begin my photographic adventure on US Route 1. First of all, the weather's pretty nice compared to the Delaware Valley where I came from, especially this week because they got about a foot of snow back there while I was, while I was away, so good choice. The second thing is, I know my section of Route 1 in Philadelphia, City Line Avenue, really well. I, I cross it probably 10 times a week, and it's about five miles from where I live. So, the nice thing about Raleigh is I really don't know my way around. I really don't know what it's like. I can learn here. I can listen here. Even over the din of the highway, I can listen. So despite my tendency to wax poetic about all the old, rusty, dusty things that I find along Route 1, Raleigh is going to keep me focused on all of the stuff that's new, and what's fresh, because there's a lot of that along Route 1, and it's exemplified here. I intend to unveil truth. In the, in the word of Lester Bangs, I intend to be unmerciful to give an unvarnished look at the entire 2,500 miles of Route 1. This is my jumping off point. So as I ramble north and cruise south, I'm going to keep this place in mind as I interview people, get these great stories, and write some songs, take pictures, and videos. This place is going to be my touchstone. There's stories of boom towns all up and down Route 1. Ones that preceded Cary, North Carolina. And they're, they're just full of great stories. I'm gonna dig them up. I started in Raleigh. Probably always come back to Raleigh. Find another way, find another way to set you free.